everybody. It's Jen. How are y'all doing? It is round seven. 600 calories for me. My mop. Day 10. And I was 189.0 this morning. And I started this round at 202.0. So I've lost 13 pounds after 9 weigh-ins. And it's pretty good. I am 6 pounds from the my free admission to the 100 pounds loss club. Yay! I'm three pounds and change from my lowest weight ever of 185.4 and I only hit there once before but I think I've been 185.6 for two or three days so on two separate rounds. <laughs> so and I'm exactly 19 pounds from my 170 pound goal and I'm Five ten and a half, so 170 pounds is a foot into the normal weight range of where I have never in my life been. I, except when I was born. <laughs> so I wanted to uh, tell y'all about a P3 meal or a P3 fast food place to get a meal and. I would use it as a P2 emergency meal myself, especially since I do the, the 600 calories, but you could eat three-fourths of it or something and be fine. Panera Bread, which uh, is a national chain, kind of like, kind of like Jason's Deli, um, a not as fancy, not as rich um, I can't think of the name now. That little French cafe. Mm. What's that French restaurant? La Madeleine. La Madeleine. Thank you. I kept thinking Marie Calendars. La Madeleine. Um, not near as fancy as that, but, you know, it's just, this place prides itself on um, organic and, uh, and, you know, whole foods and, and kind of gourmet twists on things, you know, with like pears and cranberries in their salads and, you know, things like that. Um, they have a new, they came out with a new menu and it's called the hidden menu and it really is hidden. It's not in any advertising or on their menu boards or anything. You have to ask for it or know what you want to order in advance, but it is online. And uh, so the, the hidden menu and every dish on it, and there's eight dishes, including two breakfasts, which start with the word power. So I'm going to give you an example of one of their dishes. Um, the power Mediterranean chicken. And this is basically a salad with diced egg, chopped romaine lettuce, fresh tomatoes, applewood, smoked bacon, fresh baby spinach, all natural antibiotic free, citrus and pepper chicken, fresh California extra virgin olive oil, and fresh lemon juice. Sounds delicious to me. The whole thing is 360 calories, which is right in line with what I eat for dinner. I'm sure y'all don't eat that much, but I do. And um, it is 20 grams of fat, 9 net carbs, 12 carbs with, you know, subtract out the 3 fiber, and 35 grams of protein, and pretty low sodium too, 590 milligrams. So... I was pretty impressed. I'm going to actually probably maybe be trying it out because my aunt wants to take me to dinner coming up. So we'll see. And uh, my aunt, my favorite aunt, is a new grandma. My uh, cousin's girlfriend just went into, her water broke, and she was way early. She's like 33 weeks or something, but her baby was 3 pounds, 14 ounces. So, yay new family member and it's a girl and my girl's the youngest baby so that'll be good the next one's a girl she'll have a playmate because I have two boys and that's kind of important to me so I'm happy healthy in the NICU of course but um, so far so good so anyway 
The other thing I wanted to tell you about, oh, you can Google that hidden menu to find it, and there's beautiful pictures online. So I um, wanted to tell you about the dinner I had tonight. It's only slightly moppish. It's uh, chicken with artichokes, and you can buy bags of frozen artichoke hearts at Trader Joe's, and I'm sure other places. There's nothing else in it, just artichokes. And uh, I used my 100 grams of chicken, and... I used a whole bag of artichokes. Of course, I doubled this for my my husband had it too. But I had my 100 grams of chicken, my bag of artichokes, which is 100 calories for the whole bag. And then uh, I cooked it with chicken broth and two of those Durat garlic, frozen garlic cubes. Those are at Trader Joe's too. You can use regular garlic or garlic powder, but heavy garlic. Um, onion in some form. My husband doesn't do chunks, so I used onion powder. Um, Lemon juice, what you're allowed of the lemon juice. I, next time I'm going to put the zest in it too because I like a lot of lemon with my artichokes. Lots of good black pepper. And uh, it, the chicken was already cooked diced chicken, so it didn't didn't take long at all until it, you know the artichoke hearts were soft enough. and It was delicious, and it was a whole plateful. So just thought I'd pass that on. I'm going to be doing that again. So... Hope y'all are doing well in your New Year's rounds. So there's so many videos. I love it. I I spend hour hour and a half every night trying to catch up with videos. So y'all keep at it. <laughs> Bye.